Hey guys, Moshe the Electric Israeli is here and thank you for joining my channel in my Chevy Volt today. A little change of scenery. My Tesla Model 3 got a flat tire. I will not tell you who did that. It was not me. Anyway, so uh, it's being fixed. So now I'm waiting for the call. Anyway, uh, I want to talk to you about Tesla stock um, and Elon Musk comments. I have to tell you that my joy is dropping. How quickly Tesla uh, stock investors shrugged of what Elon Musk said last week. So just for context, today is May 5th, Happy Cinco de Mayo, 2020, uh, Tuesday. And last week on Friday, Elon Musk went on a crazy, crazy tweet storm talking about selling his property. I don't care. Uh, his girlfriend is mad at him. I could care less. He's having a, he's, he's having a baby. Mazel tov, but what do I care? Uh, the country is being fascist by not opening up. We can debate that. And then he said, the stock, uh, Tesla stock is, price is too high, in my opinion. IMO, in my opinion. It's too high. And of course, the stock went down by $80. $80 that, that, uh, uh, that Friday. And also, uh, uh, the, the, uh, there was like a discussion. Is he going to get in trouble again with the FTC? So I listened to, uh, to, with the SEC. I, I see, I, I saw all kinds of experts. People really invest. A former board, a former board member, uh, uh, of Tesla spoke on, uh, on Fox Business News yesterday. And on and on. And all they say is unanimous. The last thing you want to get in trouble with is the SEC again. He got in trouble last time when he did that famous tweet, uh, taking Tesla private at 420, got big, big punishment, $40 million, which now looks like a little slap on the wrist, really. Uh, and they said, look, Elon Musk is best when he talks about technology. Uh, we talks about solar panels, when he talks about his great products, when he talks about Gigafactory, when he talks about uh, space, uh, uh, SpaceX, all these great things that comes out of his battery technology, so important. The, when these things come out of his mouth, he is the best, best second to none, one of a kind, one in a millennia. People like this come around one in a millennia. Because they do great thing to change the, to change history, really, literally. And then he, uh, this compulsiveness, this uh, schizophrenia, whatever that is. I'm not a medical doctor, whatever that is. That he has to make comments about about uh, the stock or about uh, government policies and things like that. That really uh, doubt people of his of his you know personal makeup. Why are you doing this for? You know. You you cost people a lot of money. You cost uh, uh, Tesla value a lot of money. Now it's interesting. It came right back. Uh, this week went up one day by fifty six dollars. Today it's up like twenty dollars. So it's coming back. So people see they 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 they're like shrugging off his comments after they overreacted the, at the beginning. But of course he's not going to listen to this. But it's not me saying it. It's his best supporters. I, I, I can name you two or three who, who said this. Uh, Pierre Firajot, who's a big Tesla supporter. Uh, Catherine Woods from uh, ARK Invest. Uh, Baron Investments. People who really, and firms who really uh, 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 invest and believe in what he does, like me and thousands of people like me who, who do this, took... Talk what you know the best. Uh, we know you're different. You're not a typical CEO that talks about just numbers and all that. And I listen to every single uh, 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 earning call, and they're very interesting stuff. But then he gets on that 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 crazy streak of saying stuff that it's such nonsense and causes material loss to people. Material loss to people. Somebody bought, he sees the stock is high, he wants to sell, wants to capitalize, make money, and all of a sudden something like this happened, and then in one swoop, it's all gone. All right? So is the is the stock price too high? The stock price, it is what it is. Okay? Sometimes people ask me, well, how is the how much this thing is worth? It's however much somebody is willing to pay for it. Is it high? Is it too high? It is what it is. I think that Tesla and, and, and um, companies 
like Tesla, disruptive companies like Tesla always do very, very well in, in times of crisis. That's my opinion. Let me know yours. Thank you guys for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Share my videos. Subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow.